Hello my dear friends, welcome back to Infigyan. Today in this video we are going to solve another very interesting and challenging rational equation problem for the real values of x. Given that x cannot be equal to negative 4. So let's get started by taking 2 common from this bracket. So it will come out as 2 power 5 which is 32. So we have to write in the bracket x plus 4 and then our power is 5 over x plus 9 whole power 5 plus 3x plus 7 whole power 5 equal to 8 over 781. Now in LHS we have 32 in the numerator. So I will divide both sides by 32. Here also we will multiply denominator 781 by 32. Now we can cancel 32, 32 from LHS. We can cancel 8 and 32. So there we will write 4. So we can write x plus 4 whole power 5 over x plus 9 whole power 5 plus 3x plus 7 whole power 5 will be equal to 1 over 781 times 4. We will write 3, 1, 2, 4. Now I will switch numerator denominator. Take reciprocal both sides. As x cannot be negative 4. So I can write equation x plus 9 whole power 5 plus 3x plus 7 whole power 5 over x plus 4 whole power 5 equal to reciprocal of 1 over 3124 is 3124. Now we will split LHS numerator with respect to denominator x plus 4 whole power 5 and we can write x plus 9 over x plus 4 whole power 5 plus 3x plus 7 over x plus 4 whole power 5. This would be equal to 3, 1, 2, 4. Now we will use substitutions. So I will consider x plus 9 over x plus 4 equal to a. 3x plus 7 over x plus 4 equal to b. So the very first equation which I can write a power 5 plus b power 5. This will be equal to 3124. Now we will calculate the value of a plus b. As our denominator is same, we will write common denominator x plus 4. Then we need to add the numerator terms x plus 9 with 3x plus 7. So I can write here x plus 3x, 4x, 9 plus 7, 16. Denominator is x plus 4. Let's take 4 common from the numerator. We will get x plus 4 in the bracket. Denominator is x plus 4. So we will cancel x plus 4 with x plus 4 from numerator and denominator. So our second equation would be a plus b equal to 4. This is our equation 2. Now we have to solve this new system of equations. I will use algebraic formulas. I will write here a square plus b square. This is equal to a plus b whole square minus 2 times ab. Now our second equation was a plus b equal to 4. So I can write here 4 square minus 2ab or we will write our equation number 3 a square plus b square is equal to 16 minus 2 times ab. This is equation 3. Let us use another formula a cube plus b cube. 
दिस इज इक्वल टू ए प्लस बी होल क्यूब माइनस थ्री टाइम्स ए बी ए प्लस बी लेट्स पुट द वैल्यू ऑफ ए प्लस बी इक्वल टू फोर आई विल राइट इक्वल टू फोर क्यूब माइनस थ्री टाइम्स ए बी टाइम्स फोर नाउ फोर इज कॉमन we will write 4 times in the bracket 4 is square so 16 minus 3ab let me write this is equal to a cube plus b cube and equation we will call equation number 4 now i will multiply both 3 times 4 so i will write here a square plus b square times a cube plus b cube equal to 4 times 16 minus 2ab times 16 minus 3ab now we will multiply lhs let me write our equation here here it is now we will multiply a square with a cube we can write a power 5 b square with b cube we can write b power 5 then we will multiply a square with b cube we will write a square b cube and we will multiply b square with a cube we will write a cube b square now we can take a square b square common now so in the bracket we need to write a plus b this will be equal to 4 times 16 minus 2 times ab Times sixteen minus three ab. Now a power five plus b power five. This was equation number one. Value is three one two four. A plus b equation number two. Value is four. So I will write four times a square b square. We will write RHS four times in bracket sixteen minus two ab. Times sixteen minus three ab. Now equation is divisible by four, so let's divide both sides by four. So from RHS we will cancel four, and in LHS we will write this is seven hundred and eighty one three one two four over four plus four a square b square over four is a square b square. This will be equal to sixteen minus twice a b times sixteen minus three a b. Now we have to simplify our RHS. Sixteen times sixteen two fifty six. Then minus forty eight a b minus thirty two a b minus eighty a b plus six a square b square. Now we will take All the terms to RHS. So six a square b square minus a square b square. We will write five a square b square. Then we have minus eighty a b. Then we will write two fifty six minus seven eighty one. This would be minus five twenty five equal to zero. Equation is divisible by five. We will write quadratic in a b. As a square b square minus sixteen ab minus one zero five equal to zero. Now this is one quadratic equation in ab, which we can factorize easily. Let me write equation here: a square b square minus sixteen ab minus one zero five equal to zero. We will split our middle term minus sixteen ab minus twenty one ab plus five ab minus hundred five equal to zero. Now we will take ab common from first two terms. So in the bracket ab minus twenty one five common from last two terms. We will get the same bracket ab minus twenty one. Equal to zero. Now a b minus twenty one is common out. We will write a b plus five 
in other bracket e equal to 0. Now we can use product 0 rule. So we can write either ab minus 21 equal to 0 or ab plus 5 equal to 0. So from first equation we will get ab equal to 21 and from second equation we will write ab equal to minus 5. Now we will write our second equation a plus b was 4. So from here we can write b equal to 4 minus a which we will apply here. So I can write a times 4 minus a equal to minus 5 and 21. We will multiply, we will write 4a minus a square equal to minus 5 and 21. So we can create two quadratic equations. Once we will take all the terms to RHS, we will get a square minus 4a minus 5 equal to 0. This is our first quadratic equation. And if I will write second quadratic equation, a square minus 4a plus 21 equal to 0. This is our second quadratic equation. Now I will check the discriminant value for second quadratic. Let me calculate here d equal to b square minus 4ac. So I can write here minus 4a square which is b square as per formula minus 4 times ac. So 4 times 1 times 21. So I can write here 16 minus 84. So discriminant will be negative. We will get complex solutions. So we can cancel this quadratic equation. Now we have to solve first quadratic equation only. a square minus 4a minus 5 equal to 0. a square minus 4a minus 5 equal to 0. Easily we can find factors a plus 1 times a minus 5 equal to 0. So I can use product 0 rule and write a should be equal to negative 1 or a should be equal to 5. Now a was our substitution if you remember x plus 9 over x plus 4. This was equal to a. So I can write here x plus 9 over x plus 4 equal to negative 1 and 5. Now we will write two equations and cross multiply. So we will write x plus 9 equal to minus x minus 4. And second equation x plus 9 equal to 5x plus 20. Now we will take minus x to the left hand side and 9 to the RHS. We will get 2x equal to minus 4 minus 9 minus 13. We will divide both sides by 2 and we will get our first real solution minus 13 over 2. Now we have to solve second equation. I will take 5x to the LHS and 9 to the RHS. So x minus 5x we can write minus 4x and 20 minus 9 we will write 11. So we will get x equal to negative 11 over 4. So we are having only two real solutions. First one is minus 13 over 2 and second one is minus 11 over 4. And this brings the end of the video. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.